Hello everyone, welcome back. Today we're going to look at Mega Loot the Demo. This is a roguelike inventory management RPG. And I know that sounds like a lot of words, but let's let's get into it. So we just gotta start with the one character, 5% gold game. Uh, let's go. So there's no tutorial, but as we go in, I'll kind of teach you how to play. So down here we have the market. We can increase uh, our stats by buying these things and they go into the highlighted area. So we have $15 and uh, yeah, so we can come in here and we got wood set. We got 25% luck and we got this. So this will continue to be here until uh, we refresh it and that that refreshes every every fight so we come over here and we have a normal attack and then we have a guard attack and then normal attack and it kind of repeats like that right now we're doing heaps of damage because we got this thing but what we can do is actually buy stuff and it will level up and then we can also level up again so it's this is where the inventory management comes in where you can have like this legendary i'm gonna lock that because it looks really cool it's plus eight and plus four so it's kind of an upgrade of that but we don't have enough money but we can just come over here and just do a lot of damage and yeah so if you come over here it increases level by earning gold better items on higher level ups so we can once again just continue to attack and each each attack we do is you know more and more money we get so these guys over here, we have an ability to, uh, we have Toxify and that ability changes depending on if we're attacking or defending. So these guys that are armored receive have physical damage. They have four armor and four health. So if we just attack them, we did six damage, knocked it off. We have five armor and five health and two mana. So we can guard and that will stop us being attacked, but they weren't attacking. Because they're over here, they're armoring up. Still don't have enough money. But what we can do, if we if we sell this for five, we can buy this and equip the legendary hammer. And now we can kind of build these things up. And so over here we have the set bonus. So this set, it gives us one wood. So we only have wood, but we can have technically three. That's something we'll look for. So you can only guard three times per turn. Uh, and we did. Gotta come over here. And then we can keep these or we can sell them for one gold. It's probably better to keep them because maybe we'll use it later. So it's prioritizing the wooden set at the moment. Uh, but look, uncommon silver it's way better than armor, so I'm gonna lock that uh, for 20. Just continue. So the bat does a lot of damage. We can left click, select. So we see he's worth two gold, and he does five damage, but he only has one HP. That's very easy. This guy is a Fronk. He's a magic attack, and also he has a magic shield. So we got to be careful with that because he will buff everyone else. Here we go. We have 20. So I'm going to equip this. And this gives us our silver set. Each time you cleanse, gain a stack of inspiration. We aren't really looking for cleansing. Because I've never seen it before. So, as you can see, this is kind of... I have this leafling. It's got two attack. I think he does two attacks. And then he also does... Yes. Ooh. Magical shoes. Seven wisdom. It's a shame that we're not actually going for wisdom stuff, but we can have a look. Increased damage by 45%. Pretty good. Uh, I do want to check something. If we buy this, if we equip this. Okay. Doesn't really do anything. 13 gold. That's pretty good. Let's 
Snowpiercer. <laughs> Let's get that. Frozen Strike. I don't like anything. Oh, we should have killed this guy because he's got to guard everything. Okay. So here we are. We have five battles remaining on floor one. And I haven't really talked to you about our ability. Apply poison and confusion to all enemies. That only happens when we can guard. Um, oh, he dodged. But we also have convert. We can convert an item for from the market for battle stats. So we could come in here and we can convert this for two, ar uh, two armor. And then it's gone for good. But that two armor only lasts until the end of the battle. And it goes back down. And that's kind of like the whole way. It becomes equippedable after completing an elite battle. We haven't an elite battle yet over here poison and confusion so that's got to do three damage as well get rid of him we're on five we kind of need more and more damage Guard. 68. Wow, that's very expensive. So everything is kind of like insular inside its the toxic death. Every time your health is about to take damage, you convert it to poison and apply it to yourself. So everything inside the kind of the battle is everything gets reset except for your gold. So a training axe does four damage, which is as much as our normal axe. I'm going to go for a refresh. Refresh. Six. I don't, I don't really want poison to everyone. This will kill the two ones. We'll focus on guarding against these guys. Oh, we can't guard, so we can skip. And we have one battle remaining. These guys are like strong. If we attack, poison on everything. Oh, we don't have our multiply. That is rough. Guard. Technically he would have died, so I should have just left him. The so we're taking four poison damage, which means that we will die. <laughs> That's not good. Oh, so that, that was a lot of damage, but I guess it took us back here. We can try again. very hard I'm gonna convert this into armor and then we're gonna fight the elite pebbling he's doing five damage um, that's huge Okay, so we've got a, so we can pick one up. Two Dazzle. After popping a Sparkle, deal Dazzle damage to the target and receive 
Uh, inferior armor. I don't know how to do that. Ten evasion. Gain 1% dodge chance per evasion up to 100. Every time you dodge, reduce evasion by 50%. Or 6 max health. I kind of want the 6 max health. Because it changes the priority to the set to the warrior, hunter, golden. Down here. So I think we go hunter. We've got some more things now we can do. Um, guess we couldn't buy this when I wanted to. Max health and 10 recovery. So we should recover every turn. Recover 10 health. Ooh. Wisdom and invasion. Ultra golden leggings. Plus 20 armor. That's very cool. So right now there's probably no reason. Kind of. All that. Let's continue on. Armored, reduce damage. Know that. Every time this owner gets hit for a non direct attack, deal magic damage. Ooh, all damage there. Common chain mail. Better than what we have. 60. Every time you cleanse. Okay. Wait. Does this not have anything on it? What does not contribute? Why not? Just have the lifesteal. At the start of every battle, gain golden heart. What does golden heart do? On dropping to zero. Revive and heal for 25% of your max HP. We're just gonna attack him. He did not stand a chance. I would I would like there to be a priority set, but we haven't seen anything. So recovery max health. guess we can do that we've got no money here I kind of want that but it gives us heaps of penetration heaps of crit damage which may be useful for our for our uh, fighting skip let poison deal with them so loot stash goes here if we ever get any loot um, but kind of got to Keep it common leather pants. We can't. Oh no, we can wear pants. We just can't equip them. Oh my god, that did a lot of damage. Oh shit. Um. Ooh, okay, so luckily we healed before. This little bastard has heal. Right, so the item set limit has reached. So that way, that means that we can actually put something in that's not part of it. So this one is mercenary set. I'll put that in. We could put this. No, no, we can't. we buy this we can put this and then sell that and then put that okay stealing he stole something from me 
He escaped, apparently. That really sucks. Getting awfully low. Spellbind. I don't want to be spellbound. Wisdom. It was silence. Means we can't do anything. Oh, we can't do any spells, I should say. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna attack. Confuse everyone. This guy should be dead. Next turn. And we're attacking. Managed to gain heaps of stuff. Skeleton Warrior, he's got to attack twice for four damage each. But we got to kill the Frug. That should kill you next time. Silver Sword. Okay, cool. So we'll do physical attack times a silver attack. Hunter's Hood. Legendary. Stun attack. Let's... I don't want you to stun me or anything. Okay, how, how about we convert? We're going to take two. Okay. I think we'll have to do this. So we don't die. Very dangerous. <laughs> Very dangerous indeed. Lifesteal, crit damage. How much is this? 20 kill power? I don't know if we're going to survive this. We did not survive this, but we are... Ariel. So does this apply to the back people as well? It does not, okay. damage uncommon hunger blade let's focus on one we're going to, we're going to die how many you go You know what? Shit. Laws of death. You surpassed twenty five percent of the players. Uh, so that was Mega Loot. Kinda interesting. I, I I did like how certain people have certain different things. Like this guy here has 100% attack damage for this turn. And I, I'm guessing this turn is the whole thing. Uh, if we go 
save and exit. This guy doesn't have a weapon slot, which is kind of what tripped me up the first time I played it. Because you can come in here and be like, okay, I want 25% you know, physical attack. Or actually, let's get plus one total attack. And so now we'll be attacking twice. We can come over here and be like, sure, sure, sure. We get doubles your total attacks. So now we'll be hitting like really quick. Let's hit that. One, two, keepsake. Got some wisdom. Guarding attack. Maybe that's only on the first. Oh no! I guess if they don't die, you hit them more than once. You only have one. You can only kill one thing at a time, but you just get attacked more. Or you get an attack multiple times in the same row. I'm guessing this is kind of how it's it's set out to be. Like almost, almost a kind of merging game. We can come in here and be like, yeah, we we want more. I don't know if there's anything after legendary. Maybe there is. Could be. It weakened me. Wisdom, we don't need. Life steal. There is mythic. Very cool. Uh, and yeah, so let's see if we can get a mythic sword or something. One money. Two. Death message. Fix Sinatra's floor record. I don't know what that means. Dodge up to three enemies attacks. Worry about that really. And we're doing more damage. Skip. Okay, so this is an elite battle. I don't have a helmet yet. Okay, so that must be the best. Ooh. Continue. We should dodge next time. Pick one. Armor, combat, electricity. Apply stacks of electric charge equal to total electricity to the target on hit. It's an enemy. 
This one does. Okay, cool. You just priority to warrior. Every time you attack, you gain combat insight. That is, next time you're about to be attacked and you have five more sacks, you parry. Eric does not set the limit. Let's go. Ah, uh, that. So we got recovery. We don't want that. Don't know if that actually does anything. Helmet. Another helmet, rare silver helmet, but we have kind of max here, so gotta be careful. This does reset each battle, so we should probably. There we go, ethereal. So now we need to get 64 and we're done. Only just for like uh, this area. Just kind of wanted to, wanted to see what it did. It went up higher. I assume this thing on the side means that if we continue with this, we will keep it. And then oh, we got another one. Go. So, that's, that's kind of cool. You can see like where people died. You can even write your own message. Here we go. We have level two abyssal wooden shoes. Very cool. So I'm guessing that's leveled up, but it's, it gives us 14 armor, which is pretty good. Pretty good. I want to see, just kind of want to, wanted to keep kind of the wooden stuff going. This does a lot, of, we're doing a lot of attacks, so making a warrior out of this is... All your attacks will be critical strikes. Damn, that's really good. And then what? What's the defense one? We're at the max here. When warriors... This is kind of, a, we kind of fell into the, there we go. We fell, fell into the trap of keeping our old stuff. We leveled this up too much, I reckon. And now we're not going to be able to do anything. Okay. We're silent, so we can't do anything. And always killing ourselves on that guy. We do come back, but uh, we're not going to be able to do this. I think. Because we're hitting ourselves to 38. Um, we surpass 15% of players, which is not a lot, but <laughs> our right death message, we're going to say something. We're just going to say that. And maybe somebody will pick it up and, you know, they'll look at it. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. That was mega loot. I actually kind of enjoyed that towards, you know, end, the end once I started figuring out what to do. But yeah, the, the alpha demo. So the game does not, it's not represented in its final state. But it gives you a little sneak peek of what it's going to look like. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.